it's that time of year again. Happy Easter. So I'm going to be coloring um, eggs this uh, year with the help of somebody I don't think you've actually seen on camera in a while. Disembodied voice. Happy Easter. So I'm going to be uh, coloring some eggs. I'm going to uh, show you the colors I have and then red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet. I couldn't find actual containers. I tried. Okay, let's have some fun. Can I say it now? Say what? Say what? I cooked the eggs. You cooked the eggs? I cooked the eggs. Okay, I want to make one. It's like I carried a watermelon in um, Dirty Dancing. <laughs> yeah. What did you do? I carried the watermelon. Go ahead, pick a color. Keep sliding. Stay like that. Stop sliding, phone. But you got the stirry thing. You can use the stirry thing. I can get another stirry thing. Do you know why they use this? Because it's copper. What does copper have to do with anything? There's a hair. There's a hair on a frog on a log in a hole in the bottom of the sea. There's a hair on a frog on a log on a hole in the bottom of the sea. There's a hole, there's a hole, there's a hole in the bottom of the sea. Why? I don't know. How about here comes Peter Cottontail, hopping down the bunny trail. Hippity hoppity, Easter's on its way. Or for the pagans out there, the store is on its way. Ah, I'm trying so hard to get everybody in shot. It's okay. I can just be the disenchanted voice. I'm used to it. Disembodied. Disembodied. Okay, I do want to try the tie-dye technique. So I saw this technique online where you take some thick paper towel, you take an egg, egg, you then wrap up the egg inside the paper towel, and then you distribute the color. I'm going to use this. And I'm just going to dry the vinegar off of there, hon. Take a little bit of color and pour it onto a section of the egg. A little bit of color. Pour it onto a section of the egg. Little bit of color. Pour it on a section of the head. I'm not an egg. Could be an egg head. Well, they die nicely. Yep, you hear that? We're, we're, we're murderers. Murderers. I really hope this tie dye method works. Well, the L tastes the same when you go down your tummy, so who cares, right? Yeah, I guess. Okay, problem with the tie dye method is you have to let it sit. Ooh, if that works, that looks really pretty. I'm gonna do another one. You want you want to try Why the Why don't you wait to see how it looks first? Mm. What do you think of my green? Pretty. Oh, Mom, when they're all dry, can we do that pew, 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 pew thing? Tomorrow. Okay. I want to get some kibasa and kishka, but... We're Greek, Macedonian. 
slash Ukrainian insanian gypsies. <laughs> insanian. <laughs> okay, now I want to do one which is just like the blue, the indigo, and the purples. Okay, I need a drawing place. But I'm having fun. So isn't that all that matters? Here. Can I show my egg off? What do you think? Purdy. Purdy. Oh, oh I think you cracked your egg. Oh no. Is it a bad crack? I don't think so. But as bad as the crack in my head. Oh well. Okay, and I'm back. Um, my phone, my recording device ran out of storage. Anyways, as I was saying, hopefully, uh, I'm not exactly sure when it cut out. Hopefully, not too much, but back to this. Back to the tie-dye eggs. There we go. Uh. There's also a method you can do with a crayon. Uh, if you can find a white crayon, you draw little designs on the egg with the white crayon, like hearts or crosses or whatever. And then where you don't have the crayon and you- The, the wax, it'll cover it up so you can layer it, which is kind of cool. Yeah. I always feel like we have way more, more dye than we need for the amount of eggs we do over here. Well, there's only two of us eating them. Mm -hmm. That's that's a cool one. Mm -hmm. Can I have some red? Well, you can finish taking your egg at first. Oh, I'm d letting it die some more. Okay. I'm trying to get spots on it like you did, but in a different technique. Oh, I got spots on my egg because I didn't stir the, the coloring enough. Okay, I gotta get this out now without dropping it. I'm really excited for how the tie dye ones turned out. Why is this one being so difficult? Because it's you? It's girls. Yay! I got a hair on this one too. <laughs> this is not friggin' fair. I know, you know, rabbit's hairs are supposed to be part of Easter, but give me a break. <laughs> there you go. I'm just doing the solid color. Okay. But you don't need to open these up now. I've never done this tie-dye method before, so I don't know if it works. I hope it did. Yeah, I really. made it too thick. I made it too thick. Oh no, did none of them turn out? Did I make it too thick on all of them? I made it too thick. Well, that's, I like that. Or oh, I didn't let I it like soak that. long enough. What it was supposed to look like, this is what it looks like. Well, you've already got a green one. Just, just, just let me wallow in my pity that I messed it up. So just don't get the and other make ones. It, try to make it fancy. I don't know if I should have maybe just let it sit longer or what. I'm gonna try squeezing the color onto this one. Okay, well, this tie dye method is poopy. Mm. Your method is what? It's poopy. 
In other words, it doesn't work. I'm trying a different method. Just one paper towel then. You know the darker colors are going to take control. I know. Don't put it beside mine. You're going to screw mine up. Oh, who is pawing at me from under the table? It's a jasmine. So we could, I could boil some more eggs, but it would take a, a while, and then they have to cool. And I'm really disappointed that that. I like that one. Mm -hmm. And that one. Don't mind me. I never do. Mm. <laughs> now this is my real laugh. I always laugh like this. And if you want to hear me burp, well, that's another story. Mm. Oh, uh, the neighborhood we live in is doing something I think is absolutely adorable. They went around delivering everybody's mailbox, this little flyer that says if you want to go on an Easter egg hunt, it's going to be all measured out, you know, so there's social distancing. And we're going to go on an Easter egg hunt tomorrow. And there's this oh, there egg you, you have to, that's cool. There's this egg you have to color and put it in the window. So I'll, you, also, you guys will also be seeing that later. If Yvonne ever gets around to putting the egg in the window. I'm putting it in the window tomorrow. You'll sleep in. No, I'm setting an alarm. Oh, excuse me. All right, and here are the finished eggs. We've got attempted tie dye. Didn't really work. Another attempted tie dye. Didn't really work. Another tie dye, which did kind I like of work. This pattern right there. Oh, I didn't even realize it took like the the the, the texture of the uh, cloth. Yeah. Got the pretty green. You want Christmas. Just the only ones you weren't using. You kept hogging all the other ones. I think the purple one's my favorite. Mm -hmm. And then there's these little twirly tops they give you that you're supposed to play with toothpicks. And woo! Or. Not when there's You can twirly. give them a hat. So, uh, yeah, uh, happy Easter. Um, happy stay Easter. safe. Um, stay healthy. healthy. Uh, just because of quarantine uh, doesn't mean you can't still have fun. Spend time with family, loved ones. Stay safe and happy Easter. Bye-bye. Cool.